get this. This story is wild. It's just check this out. Like maybe the craziest story I've heard recently about an NBA player. Maybe the dumbest, most preposterous way that an NBA player has ever been suspended. This is the story. In a game against the Thunder, Miami Heat were down just nine, just down to nine players. Dwayne Dedmond, journeyman, probably gets like 12 minutes a game, getting some obvious minutes when they're down to nine men, decided to take out his, and the Miami Heat haven't been good, season-long frustration out against Eric Spolstra by getting pissy on the sidelines. Not sure what it was about, not sure if there was some sort of independent thing going on, but he decided he was going to throw a temper tantrum. Spolster and Deadman jawed back and forth for about 10 seconds before being separated. Totally fine. Nothing wrong with that. And then he gets booted from the game, and along the way, as he's being ejected, this is tremendous, he grabs a Theragun, which retail for about $499, throws it across the court where it lands in the middle of game play. At the top of the key. What? I have never heard of that before. Have you heard of that? Miami Heat players, they do some wild shit when they're mad at one another. Remember when Udonis Haslam and Jimmy Butler and Eric Spolster were all going to fight last year? They just get, there's something about that Miami air, man. This is insane. So today, the league, after consulting with Pat Riley, decided they were going to hand down a one-game suspension to Dwayne Dedmond. Which means my man Dwayne Dedmond got suspended for throwing a massage gun onto the court. Something that Deshaun Watson should familiarize himself with. A massage gun to do it himself. (laughs) Spolstra, who's sneaky, fiery, very... uh, much more bombastic than people realize. He said this, that's the Miami Heat. We're all a bunch of gnarly personalities. What are you talking about? Just throwing shit? Scr- I, like, I bet a player, if they scratched each other across the face, like, that's gnarly heat culture for you. What does that even mean? That's like when I went to watch Arizona play Oregon and some girl took her Nuva ring out of her own body and put it on my shoulder. Be like, oh yeah, that's wild cat culture. No, that's fucking out of pocket. That's not adult activity. Gnarly heat culture. I'm just going to throw. Have you ever felt a Theragun? They're heavy as fuck. If that would have hit baby Lowry in the head as he's coming up, he could have been concussed. He could have been out there just absolutely rocked. Devman's averaging six and four on 10 minutes per game. I don't think he's going to have more of that moving forward. I don't know. I, it's just, it, what's next? Th- one Theragun? I don't even know. I don't even, this has got to be one of the craziest stories I've ever heard.